I hope you understand why we brought you in today. No, I don't. But I'd love an explanation. Well, as you might have heard, Mr. Bankington has been reported missing. He hasn't been seen in the last 24 hours. Tell me, do you know Mr. Bankington? Yeah, I've seen him around before. It's reported by a close source that you were seen with Bankington two days ago, under the clock tower. Is this true? Yeah, it's true. Do you care to explain? Sure. Bankington and I had made arrangements to get dinner that afternoon. We would plan to meet at the clock tower. Did you hear that? Hear what? That, that oink noise. You didn't hear it? I have no idea what you're talking about, Thomas. Whatever. Where were we? Southside. That's right, Southside. I took Bangington with me to Southside. He paid. And what did you get? Um... Hmm... Tell me you hear that! Please tell me you hear that! I don't hear anything, Thomas. Seems to me you're just trying to buy more time. Now, you really can't remember what you ate? Jesus Christ, it was two days ago. I can't even remember what I ate this morning. A cheeseburger. That's right, a cheeseburger. Okay. You had a cheeseburger. And what happened after that? Nothing. I walked back into the back to the room and went to my next class. And that was it? Yeah, that was it. That was the last time you saw Bankington? No, no, it's not the last time I saw Bankington. Go on. I wrapped Bankington up. I took him into the forest. And I beat him with a hammer till he was no more. I killed Mr. Bankington. I broke your piggy bank. I was just so sick of it. Why would anyone buy a piggy bank that oinks every time you put money into it? It was a gift from my grandmother. She collected pigs. She collected pigs? Yes. People do that. No, they don't. Look, all I know is you owe me one dollar and seventy-four cents. And I want a new Bankington by Friday.